The album of the year has been released today. I'm filming Christine's documentary. She asked me to. It's two guys stood on stage, and it's pure, and it's like, and you can't fuck with it. In the deep, like, caverns of, like, small towns in England, that is where great music exists. The smell of piss is so strong, it smells like decent bacon. Kevin's getting fucked loose on the overspill, underneath the piss station. They are the voice of Britain. They tell what Britain is like at the moment. If you were on, like, £15 a week, and you turn the telly on and some fuckers spouting on about love, you know, with a guitar in the middle of a forest. Yeah. I mean, that's just shit. It is a band that, on paper, shouldn't really appeal to people, but it does. King out of the film, actually. Yeah, it's a band with old men. We both felt like we've not fit in, fit in anywhere. <laughs> I think I've beaten off more than I can chew with this fucking voice of the people tag they keep fucking giving us. Yeah. Jesus. Do you really? Yeah, fucking, they can stop that bollocks. So it's like an independent label, an independent band that's totally away from regular music business. Business? Oh, big bus. I did tell the wife I thought I was a rock star the other night, though. That's fucking shit, isn't it? Uh -uh. <laughs> Felt like we were a proper band. What we've done over the past couple of years has been fucking groundbreaking in terms of what we've got away with. Just crazy. Yeah, it's How the fuck has it got to this? <laughs>